listening to Headline Hunter with Nick Rossetta. Oh, we got the music coming. I like this song. You picked this one, right? I did. Oh, I, we talked about this last week. Yeah. This is, it just puts me in a good mood. You know? I know. I'm excited. Anyways, Vince, uh, well, while you're setting up over there, if you're new to the show, uh, our Florida Man segment is just how we like to end it off. I read Vincent headlines that are Florida Man-esque. Some of them are real. Some of them are fake. You got to tell me which ones, which, which one it is. I'm in. You Let's did, go. You, you did pretty good at the rapid fire uh, last week. I did. And your, those were your original ones that we did for the first time. And that was, uh, let's just say, shocking it's with sh- what you've come up with <laughs> on your own, Nick. But um, I, I have a lot of free time on my hands. Yeah. But I'm not, like, making, you know, rocket fuel or, you know, calling in bomb threats. But is this how this it starts? This is what I do. Is this how it starts, This though? is how it starts, I think. We'll see. I'll talk with my therapist. All right. <laughs> uh all right, so how we start the segment, March 11th. If your birthday's on March 11th, here's your Florida Man headline. Florida Man tries to eat stolen debit card. It's a real headline. But uh, happy Congratulations birthday. for that. That yeah. is your Florida Man. Take that. Use it in your Tinder bio or whatever. I'd love to, I'd love to see that. Uh, oh, my God. I read that this morning. I was like, oh, my. <laughs> how do you even try to eat a stolen debit card? And first, why would you eat it? Stupidity. Well, like, I feel, like, was he thinking he was going to poop it out later? Maybe. Like, don't, like, maybe it's metaphorical. Maybe he's like, I'm going to be worth so much now. My self-worth maybe. has skyrocketed. Like, yeah. never hey, self-worth's yeah. on the inside. Oh, exactly. oh that's what card. he was going with. on the inside. That's yes. poetry. I know. Exactly. Yes. I saw the snapping. Oh, yeah. That. All right, Vince, you ready? I'm ready. Let's go. All righty. Here's our first uh, Florida Man headline. Uh, Florida man steals four thousand dollars worth of chicken and ribs. Is that real or fake? That's real for sure. That is totally real. It's not. I made that one up. Okay, fair enough. That's pretty good, eh? That was we're pretty start, good. We're, start, we're starting that was, off hot. That was reasonable. <laughs> like that was that was easy to believe. I would say compared to most of the stuff you have given me. I know. I I thought I'd. We're just warming up here. Oh yeah. It gets crazy. Okay. All right. Here's our second headline. Florida man struck by a car at a convenience store. Ask if his beer is okay. Is that real or fake? That's real. You think that's real? I feel like that that would happen here in Ontario. Oh, I believe that. For sure. Small town Ontario? Oh, oh yes. Oh, yeah. Well, it is real. It Let's did go. happen. So the crash happened Tuesday night at the uh, just a local liquor store, convenience store. The sheriff's office said a 21-year-old woman driving an SUV meant to hit the brake but missed and smashed through the glass doors of the store. Calling this just short of a miracle, the sheriff's office said the victim was taken to the hospital with injuries to his face and is expected to recover. While first responders tended to the victim, he was talking and remained in unusually good spirits, asking deputies if, it, if the beer he had just purchased was okay. <laughs> Can you blame him? I mean, no, if I just bought a beer, I'd want to make sure it was good. Maybe it was a Corona and lime, too. <laughs> it was a lacquer ice. <laughs> We see those all the time in downtown Toronto. Or the cold shots. <laughs> the cold shots, The cold yeah. shots. The $5 cold shots. Oh, yeah. All right. You ready? I'm ready. Florida man advertises legit counterfeit money on Craigslist and is arrested. Is that real or fake? He advertises legit counterfeit money. Counterfeit money. And is later arrested. That's real. You're going with real? I guess it's got to be real. What do you real. guys think? Think it's real? Fake. Um, fake? Who said fake? I said fake. You said fake? Yeah, fake well, for sure. Uh, Vince, you suck at this game, man. Damn uh, it. It is not. I made that one up. I thought that was pretty clever. That was clever. Again, somewhat reasonable. Not yeah. really reasonable. Haley's got a hot streak here. You're doing pretty good. All right. You ready, Vince? Next headline? I guess so, unless you're going to be mean again. <laughs> Florida man arrested after urinating on an in-law's carpet during Thanksgiving gathering. <laughs> Is that real or fake? Come on. Uh, the look you're giving me, I'm going to say that it's it's real. It's real. Vince, I'm, I'm, I'm trying to help you out here, man. Okay, my, part of me wanted that to be real, so that's why. Well, that's fair, but also it's March, so. Okay, <laughs> fair enough. I could have thought that through a little bit better. That's I think fair. I just got excited about it. 
just the thought of it. Well, it was like the dolphin one I made up last week. You were, oh. giddy, you were giddy on that one. That one was good. <laughs> All right. You ready? Yeah, let's go. Florida man steals crossbow by putting it down his pants. Is that real or fake? Well, there's been two fake ones. I'm going with the, the whole multiple choice logic. I'm going with real. Vince, that is your first correct answer. Ah. Let's give him a little round of applause. Thank you, everybody. I'll be here all night. <laughs> no, actually, just until six. So there's actually so there's actually a video with this one. So a new surveillance video captured a man allegedly stealing a crossbow from a hardware store by stuffing it down his pants. I just find that hilarious. Out of anything to stuff down your pants, it's a crossbow. A crossbow, and how, how do you? And can I say, I saw that video, and he was really just like, he walks down the aisle, kind of looks around, then just like pulls open the pants and just kind of starts putting it down in there. Then he walks around some more, readjusts a little bit, and then went on his way. That's so nonchalant. Yeah. Like, that's so like, sorry. I'm not doing he's, anything. He's playing it off. He wasn't yeah. scared. He's just like, well, I don't think this is quite fitting. Let me adjust it a little bit. <laughs> that's like, you know, like people like in the States will wear like pistols on their hip and like, tuck it into their belts or something. Yeah. They're like, you know, just into their pants. It's like, imagine someone walking up to you and they're like, you know, imposing a threat on you and they like go to like reach for a crossbow and pull it out of their pants in like one second. And it's huge. One like, second. This thing was massive. Like what's going on? I don't know. I'm, I'm a little concerned. Alrighty. <laughs> and uh, last one before we go into the rapid fire. Uh, Florida man. Without criminal history, jailed for five days after mistaken for someone else. Real or fake? That's very intricate. Can you read that again? Florida man without criminal history, jailed for five days after mistaken for someone else. Yeah, I would say that that's real. That is real. Valentina found this one. It's a very interesting story because he was just a, a cook at a restaurant and he was arrested and he spent 24 hours in jail before they realized they had the wrong guy. It's pretty interesting. How do? You, that's, that's a big. That's a big mess up. I don't know. I just work here. Yeah, exactly. <laughs> I, I really can. <laughs> All right, Vince. We have. We are almost out of time, so we're gonna do the rapid fire. Are you ready? I'm ready. Let's go. All right. Just tell me if it's real or fake. Walmart was evacuated after a Florida man was found crawling through the ceiling. Is that real or fake? Fake. Uh, no, that's true. Uh, Florida man on bath salts head headbutts car slaps fire chief. That's totally believable. Uh, that one's fake. I made that one up. Oh. Uh, Florida man drinks goat blood in ritual sacrifice, then runs for Senate. Real or fake? Real. No, that's fake. I made that one up. Drunk Florida man <coughs> drives lawnmower on the highway. Real. That's got to be real. That's a real okay, one. thank you. Florida man sets hospital bed on fire to get nurses' attention. That's fake. Uh, no, that's real. <laughs> uh, Florida man steals operating table from hospital. <laughs> Off what table? Operating table from a hospital. <laughs> yeah, that's got to be real. Come on. No, it's not. <laughs> Come on. <laughs> uh, Florida man sets apartment complex on fire after manager told him to stop masturbating in front of windows. Ah, uh, that's a fair enough reaction. Yeah. You think real. it's real? No, real. It's, I made that one up. Oh. Uh, Florida man tells police bag of cocaine found in car must have blown in from the wind. <laughs> real or fake? Real? <laughs> that is true. Uh, Florida man clings to semi truck speeding down highway. Uh, fake. No, wait, hold on. That's that's real. That's definitely happened. Yeah, it is real. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And the last one before we go, Florida man tries to trade alligator for twelve pack of beer. Fake. That is fake, Vince. Much better on the rap.